Hello everyone, it's Nancy here. Welcome back to our live tutorials. We are live now and hope everyone have a great Monday and hope you all have a great, Hello, it's Nancy here. sorry, it's my phone. So, um, hope you have a great weekend with your family and let me see. I just want to say hi to everyone. Uh, a lot of scheduling going to change things in the future. So please stay tuned. I'm still going live, but we are going to do two nail designs. So then we're going to do it, keep it really nice and simple. And one day we're going to do is short nails. And one day we're going to do long nails. And we're going to do is alternate liquid and powders and all different products along with a lot of questions. So probably we are going to do two nails and basics to advance so then everybody can really enjoying it and you're not gonna feel overwhelming and also you will have to learn a lot of different techniques without like overwhelming and wanna keep it like that hi Karina hello everyone on Instagram and Facebook thank you so much for tuning in hi Mama Vic hello hi Mika hey thanks so much everyone hi Janice hello thanks so much for tuning in Hi Lupita, thank you everyone for tuning in. Just make sure, um, stay tuned for a lot of different like uh, glitz contest is still going on with baby mix jars going on October 22nd date line. Make sure you tune in, in post it and tag us. Uh, more information on our highlights glitz contest. Super fun, easy, simple. How are you Mama Vic? Thanks so much for tuning in. So a lot of things cool changing is still uh, I'm still here every night with the live stream. We're gonna do two nails only one day short nails one day long nails And we're gonna save some time for as uh, Q&A and probably it's one we're gonna select in one day of the week We're gonna do a Q&A then I get to talk right in front of you if any question like regarding to you know what is anything anything generals with um, be, become a nail technician you think you are able to become a nail technician or a lot of questions regarding to how build how to build clients tales how to handle with clients how to able to um working and consult with the clients with the services a lot of things i think that is going to be an awesome uh, content we would love to support our nail techs and for all of you out there so then you don't feel like not confident at all or you are not sure you doubt about yourself that you are in the right career so that is something that we're seeing it and we absolutely would love to be part of it to support every single of you so hey julian hey hey thanks so much for tuning in say hi eric i just want to stop by and say hi to everyone hi keja so hi cc and we're gonna announce the winners the end of a live tutorial it's gonna be a really cool short tutorial we're gonna do two nails from now on uh, for the tutorial because i would like to keep it like the team decide to keep it really nice and short video just in case that you can't tune in you can absolutely be watching them for like less than an hour tutorials and short clips so then we can all learn it you know together and then today's one of those really cool our one of our favorites channel for number 16 I took two colors out of it really cool and nice we're gonna do something cool short nail so this is the look of last saturday we did with baby mix jar we had such a great time on saturday and congratulations to the winner if you haven't emailed us please email so and then for the winner to be qualified you make sure you get three colors out of four and then you have to you know like really specify about what colors you pick because there are some colors really easy to similar like for instance light light um orange and bright orange you make sure you get one of it you can't say general is orange so then that way we're all in the same team and fair for everyone and fun is most priority so we did this one and um we did have a spin and a spin spin and pick the colors that's why i created for you so hope you're really enjoying it and if you are really enjoying it and you have one of the mix jars from your treasure bags or from the mix jar just buying by itself, feel free to enter to win a contest uh, giveaway, baby mix jars. So then that way you get chance to win another uh, 12 uh, brand new baby mix jars. That's 
mix in. Hey, Dom. Hello. Hi, Mika. Everybody here. Hi, Keja. Thank you so much for tuning in. If I miss anyone, um, I just don't want to miss anyone. I want to say hi to everyone. Hi, China. How are you? Thank you. Thank you so much for tuning in. And make sure when you're doing, you tag on the name, the uh, reposting post. Make sure you post and then tag us. Hey, Laurie. And if you tag your friends, you don't tag us, you don't, we can't see it. And then it's gonna be so sad, we will miss you. So um, just make sure that, so we're all in the same team. So this week gonna be, for all of you, it just really is brand new and just tuning in. Make sure when we post the post, when we, when we post the post after life, you have to share into your post and your post need to be public so we can see it. However, you need to tag us, which is not only at Glitz Accessory and such, you tag us so then the team can view your picture. So then we'll make sure we don't miss you. So if you don't tag, we don't seeing it. And you, if you don't repost it, then it's not gonna be um, count. So the, when you post, plus you tag so many of your bestie, then it's count. If you are just tag your bestie and don't repost, it doesn't count at all. I just wanna make sure that we're all in the same page so we don't misunderstood each other's, then it's everybody gonna be fun and everybody get chance to win. So good luck everyone for this week and we're gonna announce the winner of last week after the live and we only have two nails today so it's gonna be so much fun. And hey Jane, how are you? Hi Chandra, how are you? Hi Shanda, hello, hi CC. Okay, so I have two nails, it's really cool. I have a black nails here and I just put the matte top coat on. The reason it is because I am going to apply the chanfu foil and I will using it probably a V-shape and diagonal. So if you want to do all and tie the nails, absolutely you can. Here, let me show you. This is the premium Iho Chanfer foil. If you're using the Iho Chanfer foil, then you probably need to keep a 60 second or longer. It depends on your LED lamp. Uh, the Chanfer foil, yep. Hey, hope everyone have a great Monday. Hey, Copy, how are you? Hi, Marie, hey, how are you? So let's do this one in a like chevron shape, like V shape. You can do all and tie the nails. You can absolutely, or you can do this kind of a jelly looks absolutely great too. And you don't need to be like this to be perfect because, <coughs> excuse me, we are gonna do something with that. Okay, let's here this one for 30 seconds. And doesn't matter, either you're gonna do this one. And then the dot tool, or you can use toothpick. This one is built in, that's what he'll say. So hope everyone have a great day. And if you have some questions for me, after two nails, we can absolutely have time for Q&A. So we're changing a little bit of, of planning for tutorials. So then if you have a, a lot of questions for like, how much should I or should you chalk this nail designs on the top of your um, the service you already have, then please feel free to bring it up the question as well because sometimes we're just doing so many of tutorial and you, we didn't have chance to talk about the pricing and how you can able to handle the um, clients. And it's a lot, of, a lot of things besides just beautiful nails. So I know it and I absolutely working close with you and uh, support you all the best we can. So I am placing the chanfer foil and rub it really thoroughly. Look, it looks like it come right up now. So here's a tip and trick because I'm doing like kind of a V-shape for this. What I did, I put the matte top coat on the color first. So the reason it is so then it would not 
um, staining or is sticking on the tacky layer. Or you can put the top coat first and then do a coat of a chamfer foil. But sometimes, uh, no wipe top coat is really shiny and you can't really see it well. So I put the matte top coat, it doesn't affect anything at all. It just, it's just help you to see it better. So I'm gonna use one of these colors which is Weaver Gel Teal. You can do any colors you want. You can do like um, a different colors. So I am gonna give it to like this one shop like that. Hey, last night Eric did really cool nails. Thanks for sharing. So nice. We really okay now here for 60 seconds or if you are flash here, then you can do it for 30 seconds. I will be here in the back, y'all. Still working, lava lava, but watching and listening. Oh, thanks so much, Eric. I don't know. So we're trying to find the right, picking the right time. It feel like. Hey, Nene, how are you? Hey, Jesse. And I'm using this teal. So for all of you just tuning in for the giveaways this week, we are going to do create two nails and then you only need to do to repost it on your, on your um, page. And on your page, make sure you tag us at Glitz Accessory and such and hashtag Glitz Accessory and such and con Glitz Contest. So then that way we can see it. Um, but if you post it and you tag up, but you don't tag your friends on our post, then it doesn't count. So make sure you follow all the instructions so you won't miss it. Cause I'm so excited for all of you. So let me get into the condensed glue gels. Really thick density. I just got a brand new one because I'm out of the previous one already. So apply it, not necessary if you know where you apply it, which is I know that I'm applying right here. I just get a little bit background in the black there. It's a little bit hint of flowers. However, you can put the brighter one on. I think it's gonna look gorgeous as well. And no wet top coat. If you want matte top coats, then you put matte. But if you want shiny, then you put just shiny on. So however your clients like. Um, you can add the uh, finish of what they prefer. So I don't know, is that gonna be a good time? But I think it's good for um, us to watching earlier so you won't be too tired to seeing what's going on. Okay, so I have a really cool um, luxury piece. It looks really cool and it's like a statement. However, feel like if you feel they are too big you have a hundred different kind you can add it on easy finding them from a five dollars nail art section a freaking cool and stunning it definitely worth like especially tomorrow if you want to see more of hand craft flowers I absolutely can do that it just you don't know how crazy is amazing look and also save you a ton of time to sitting there for an hour to doing it but also i'm not going to lie to you because it's really enjoying it when you have some time to sculpting the flower itself So we're changing our schedule a little bit. We're still live every single night. I don't know if I can ever not go in live to see all of you. But we're gonna do two nails and I am gonna try to, um, I'm calling back to basics, which is I might need your help to your existence to stop me if I'm getting a little bit too far with Crystal. You know, I have a plans for us, what I am going to do 
and I want to start playing with this and I will end up with doing too fancy and or too dramatic and if a lot of you might like, uh, what if the clients don't want it too fancy then you can just stop before I put the crystal you can add just like a couple of pieces of the crystals on you don't have to go too much all right that's all I am gonna key this one for uh, 60 seconds messy so you can lost the top of it all right so go into the next one and we're gonna do a precision glue on the last and this one I'm gonna do just half of the nails and again a premiums I uh, hold chamfer foil 30 second here however if different lamb will give you a little bit time frame of curing so if you find out that your LED lamb need to cure a little bit longer just give it you know extra time to cure so then that way you can able to chamfer everything so half of the nails here for 30 seconds every time i come around your cd bling bling hey keja thank you hope you're enjoying it so I have a really cool the weaver gels and the bright yellows here. So let's see. This is the first uh, nails. That's the first look. It's really cool. If you don't like that big, I don't know. I just love it. You can do a smaller, um, like say, it's really cool about this. It already have a frame on it. So it's absolutely really cool charms. Or you can get it down a little bit smaller in uh, the crimson's centerpiece. That one looks super stunning and cute as well. But if you're first time um, doing a crystal placement, get one of really cool centerpiece and then you can place frame and another smaller crystal. Doesn't have to be exactly the same colors. Can be a different colors. It can be a variety. It can be a, a mixed colors. And I have it right here. You can mix anything on it. You can mix blue, green, however colors you prefer. I'd use this for the smaller nails, but if you're longer, then you can using a different centerpiece. So I'm going to using Weaver Gels bright yellow. And oh, sorry. I said wait. It was good that you you said wait. You said wait. You need a chance for foil first. I'm skipping a shortcut. Hey, Shireni, how are you? Hey, thank you, Dom. Okay, so I have beautiful oil on mine. The reason it is we're doing the two nails now because then I get time to like Q&A if you have any questions. And then also, if you miss the live video, you can absolutely watching the videos over. And it's only take you maybe half an hour to watch them instead of take you two, three hours to watch them all. Why do you say, like, okay, give it to me. I said, wait, we don't need to cure this. Okay, so I'm gonna using that and pick. So if you want your string to be thinner, then pick less, but you want more, you can absolutely pick it more. So I'm gonna give it just like that. All right, so key for 60 seconds. If you flash key, 30 seconds. Oh, nice. The ready. She ready. Thanks so much for tuning in. Oh, thank you, Messi. CC, I will be up until 5 a.m. watching. You know what? Be honest, I can be here and stream until 5 o'clock. But then you're like, oh my god, Nancy, I don't know where to watch your part because I miss this and I don't know what I should go back into. So, okay, 
condensed glue gels. Really thick density. This could be for really nice for fall nails. It doesn't have to be in like all Halloween theme. I just want to all of you like some clients so you don't want anything with Halloween. Or you can do this, the background can be uh, orange colors. And you can still have fun flowers on it and it's still themed in uh, October's and fall theme without really like scary nails. They can still able to do a lot of fun nails without have to do like Halloween. So let's see. We're gonna do a no wipe top coat on that. And if you want matte top coat, you go ahead and put the matte on. If you want a shiny or if you want a shimmery uh, glitter top coat, you can put a glitter top coat on. However your clients prefer and however you like. If your clients give you a freestyle, I'm gonna pick really cool big centerpiece right here. It's kind of heavy though, but it's really nice. It's built in a lot of uh, crystals and the back is really nice. It's gold curve with the nails. I'm gonna leg it right there. It's really stunning. And just a couple on the side. And uh, Facebook and Instagram seems okay. Can everybody okay seeing it okay? So the reason we do this is going to be cool, fun watching, you all won't get tired from my live videos and you can just stop in by and learn for half an hour daily and get a great idea for the clients on next day. I hope you really enjoying it. You know, hey, any comments, any suggestions, any feedback are uh, welcome. So if you miss a lot of tutorial, a lot of videos, seeing so many different techniques, feel free to browse through our IGTV. There are the series there it's on the top. You can see IGTV and it will guide you to like Chantal Foy, Fusion Ink, um, Gel Painting. And so many more like crystal placements, how to apply precision glue, how to use a lot of different cool tools. So feel free to browse through all those. If you can't find anything, something that you would like to see, let us know and we can either, if we haven't done any video like that, we absolutely gonna do the tutorial for all of you. If we see that we have done quite so many times, we absolutely gonna send you the link for a lot of pre preference links from the video we did so hope you all can enjoy it and be more successful with what you're doing so that's it i am going to cure this one for 60 seconds i think i have an extra of this one right there hey liveras how are you all right, here for 60 seconds. Let's make sure I don't slide them anywhere. That is awesome. So in the meantime, I am going to put the precision glue. I don't know if I can do without it because I always have the feeling actually is gonna be like happens catching on the hair and then the clothes. So I'm going to take the first cap off and the red uh, needles off. Don't do that ones away because you are gonna need it to protect your back when uh, your precision glue don't like not be used. So you can keep it safe and it lasts you a long time. It's gonna waste your every single penny of your investments. I'm telling you, you can use it all the way until you have a last like drop. So I really have to say thank you so much for every single of you for amazing love and support. Hope our tutorials will be really 
half full and you all can count on us to be on your side and support you so we only have two nails each live tutorials so it's gonna be fun so everybody will learn something and it will not overwhelming everyone yeah that's fun and then we're gonna do q a after this okay so then we we'll, we we'll do two nails so we we'll have more time to play right we can't wait for hours like stream studio to get back and ready so then we can't able to streams more you might see me in the middle of the day going stream and say wait what are you doing over here nancy i'm checking on all ya oh this is so beautiful this one this is so freaking cool brilliant i like staying in concrete you can coat the pearls if you prefer i would because i would not coat the crystals but i will coat the pearls because it's the pearl so fragile i would coat it it doesn't change anything it's make it shinier though all right here for 60 seconds and this is the nails that we did see that's how fun and easy right thanks so much already thank you thank you Hey, Jane, you're still here. We are still here. Thank you so much for tuning in. So I guess you can start by going quick on how much you should charge for the nail. And then if anybody have questions and you want to ask, feel free to comment in. And we're going to go through it as much as we can. Yep. So here's the two nails. So if you want to do the clients on this nail, and you do, and you can do on two ring fingers. It doesn't have to be necessary. I'm going to do every single live. We're going to do two nails and it's kind of, um, a similar style, like a same in the range style like this. You can do on the left hand ring fingers, right hand ring fingers. So then this with this one, yeah, it's going to break into two different things. If with this one, if you're doing just, for instance, if the client's like, okay, Nancy, I just want a crystal placement only, right? So if the clients want just simple placement or you want a really nice, fancy, uh, dramatic centerpiece, so with this nails, if you do a centerpiece and you're doing it to uh, the crystal and the frame and the bead, so the just just talking about the crystal itself is you should charge at least twelve dollars for the crystal itself and then now you have your five dollars of chance for foil so i'm talking about this we're doing combination so if you combine of each different techniques layer on each other's is at least minimum of five dollars because you're doing combo together so that's for this nails if on the top of it you have a weaver gel and you have a chamfer foil and then you have a crystal so five dollars for chamfer foil five dollars for the weaver gels and then twelve dollars for crystal however however now if the clients don't want to get all a fancy centerpiece like that they can get like nancy can you do something like ten dollars or eight dollars you can get a smaller centerpiece or you can work on the smaller crystal without a, a little bit more fancy and expensive of um, of a centerpiece for you so then you can dial the price and without changing a dramatic look you can still get in a in a theme in the red so you can do it like um this centerpiece I'm talking about you know so you can do that and with the beads, so then you can do it like $10 or $8 and you can add with $10. So then about $18 for the nails for on the top of the new set. So, and all the clients, oh, I like a crystal so much. All the clients are like, oh, it's a little bit more like a price than I expecting. So they said, now great, so no problem. We can take off on the chamfer foil because in this case, the chamfer foil is kind of hidden, like really subtle. So like, I would suggest the clients that if you are, um, thank you so much everyone, hope you like it. But if you if you like want to get the crystal the most, or you care for the chamfer foil, which one you will pick, which one you can live without. 
So I said, oh, I really like the Weaver Gel. It stand out so cool on the black nails. And I really like the crystal. Then let's skip the chanfer foil. It's great. So then if you skip chanfer foil, it take off $5. So then basically if this design will be is $12 for the designs, the crystals, and $5. So $17 is really affordable and it's really is like reasonable price and fair for the clients and fair for you. Right? So each time you add it on, there will be more. All the clients are like, oh no, can you put some chan other chanfer foil? different colors but then i don't want weaver gel that's it great so then it's still being stay in the range of um uh 19 dollars uh i'm sorry 17 dollars so 12 dollars for crystals in the frame and then it's five dollars for weaver gels oh i'm sorry for the chanfer foil right so about 17 dollars however now they want everything and they want the color of the red then if they want to get the price a little bit less then you can suggest to get this centerpiece so still cute really really um dramatic but it's not like a lot like frames and charms like that so then because it costs you more not because you want to chalk them more it costs you more so you chalk them um the clients accordingly so is that make sense to everyone um so okay so now so for this one same thing with the centerpiece will be in the same things as well and then this one will be a 15 dollars for the crystal placements because it has like you know your pearls and then your uh, crystals and all everything built in and then more crystal and more beads on it so this one will be in your 15 dollars and then your weaver gel and chant for four so being 25 dollars per nails on the top if they're doing a two rings finger so now the client said oh i like the look like that but can i do it for ten dollars so then ten dollars then you're gonna take this centerpiece off you're gonna put like whole entire nails with just uh crystals along with this and yes you can uh scales and price it at ten dollars of the design like this instead of big centerpiece if they want a really a good statement for that so please do not heritage or is feel really like not saying or uh quote clients because they totally understand it um but take you so much to get it on like a good um good glue gels and a good of everything to keep that last four weeks like basically you have a jewelry on your nails so look at that if you are getting the quality of your like rings if you get a fashions like jewelry link uh, rings for instance it's gonna get tarnished right away and you can't wear it so long right so if you get a sterling silver it's gonna last you a little bit longer and then of course the price is gonna be a different so the same thing with a lot of things uh is pricing so make sure you feel really confident in what you're doing and charging accordingly so then the clients will not feel like we are over them or you don't want to be under because then you're getting to really upset and you're gonna be really sad and you're gonna hate what you're doing because you didn't make enough money to cover as what you have. So, you're welcome, China. China said um, that makes sense, but sometimes you get those clients who say, oh no, other nail tech chalks only $20 for a full set and $10. For all the blings, I really can't understand those people who are telling me this. So here's the best way you can not really access the clients right now. So you can not absolutely suggest them to, you know, is, I would say is great because you should check with your nail tech or all the other nail tech at $20. I think is a great, great deal. You should go with hers and a $10 for bling because if with and my service, I don't have the price for $20 for or ten dollars i'm not sure in the futures but at the moment we don't have that offer to offer you so we're probably gonna have to catch you next time if the clients understand your value and the quality of your works they shouldn't say it to you but if it does then probably the clients is not the right one for you so we're not the right one for them i guess so hey mika on facebook so hope that help um 
Did she just sing like a robot to you guys? Oh, is that? Okay, so great. Any question for me? I just want to make sure I get everything. Um, live stream is going to be a little bit different because I'm going to do two nails and I'm going to really break into, into it. And then this is a, something that realistic that I got an op like an uh, opportunity in my personal experience to do at my salon or in the Crocs three of my other salons that I got through in almost 20 years. I sharing from my heart, from my experience. I see some of my um, clients, um, my existing clients a long time and my good, good friends I'm watching and she knows that how we're standing for. Um, uh, Nene tried to email us. We have to get the email. Uh, to get that because when they ship out they have to get the email to send it everything going emails if I am um, can only help on social media but I'm not have like a power to get into email so let me know anything else we can yep send an email when you DM to send a picture but then you have to send us email yep so don't worry too much about it if you need to you should make a new Gmail account and just send it from that yep so and okay, time for announce the winner. Um, it's really excited, and I know last week is a lot of going on, and we have like four or five nails, and we have so many of contests. Um, thank you so much for like the love and support, and everyone for participating. And uh, treasure back challenge from Dom, and congratulations to the winner being uh, just being Ray. She's got the the winners on the treasure bag so then i believe the treasure bag is gonna i already i believe it's already ship it out and it's on the way so then if you email us already you should get the notifications uh for the shipping and tracking numbers and congratulations so if you like it give us a thumbs up and then the dumb thumbs up as well and then you might see our team uh like eric's or Mika or Vicky will come up with some cool contest. So stay tuned. And if you haven't get a chance to follow each of their account, make sure you do so. And is for Dom is Hey Dom Do My Nails. And for Eric's, I think is Creations. Um, uh, Eric sent me your other uh, account. So King Eric's. And uh, for Mika is Mika Do's Nails. So make sure you got all of. Um, information and then the team is really really passionate and really be here and try and help you much it so we can and get into ours i got the pictures here and then we're doing spinning wheels earlier too for the winners and here is the winner for the winner for last week what you did just simply post we going to post our nails right after live videos and only you need to do to repost in your account make sure you repost also when you repost make sure you tag us and you hashtag glist accessory and such and glist contest so then we can able to see and we don't miss your post and on our original post on our page, which is on a Glist page, make sure you tag your bestie, one of your bestie. You more you tag, the better. However, you gotta, we gotta see the repost on your page. So if you haven't done it last week already and it already passed, no problem. We can start from this week. So make sure you join us for a fun weekly giveaway. So this repost nene so repost it mean you gonna using you gonna post exact the same picture that what we have on our post and post on your page um if you if you are not sure how you can have the repost app from the ig you don't have to worry about just screenshot our pictures that's the best way i'll tell everyone so then you won't feel so overwhelming it's supposed to be fun for all of us so having fun do not stress yourself out because it's gonna be fun and it's a great chance to win a lot of gifts from us the reason why we're doing it because we're so grateful for every single of you and we will try hard every single day to support every single of you back so then they just screenshot it it's a nice screenshot or if you want to and then post on your post like a post in pictures and make sure you tag us so then we can see you 
if you don't tag, we can't see you. So it's really sad. If we miss you, it's going to be so sad. So, okay. So let's go right into the winner. And congratulations, drum bro, for last week. We checked. was having fun. And for the winner of last week is Miss Beats Barbie. I hope I pronounced it right. And congratulations. So now make sure you email us because sometimes we don't have a power to get access into the emails and they can't get all the information to the DM if we're missing it. Because every day we have so many, like a good of a few hundred to a thousand of DMs. So we really don't want to miss any of your important, like we need to ship out the price. That's the reason why we don't have a um power to touch into like really in a client so that's why it happened um if we're missing it so if we're missing it we can't pull it out so okay so please email us at info at glissaccessoryandsuch.com so when the team get it and they will send the email uh with the tracking number to you so congratulations to the winner of last week we repose and tag your bestie and tag us and repost on your page with Miss Beats, Beats Barbie. Congratulations for participating. And then, that's a good idea, Nene, using my roommate email. That's absolutely, make sure your, your roommate send, uh, put your shipping address, your shipping address, not your roommate address. So, well, his roommate supposed to be the same place, yeah. Well, but make sure your name instead of your roommate yeah. name. <laughs> yeah, make sure you get it. Hey, Miss Beat Bobby. Okay, so I hope I pronounced it right. So congratulations, you all follow all of you. Is it so many? And then we did we spinning it. So I tried to record it, uh, but it's earlier. Did you make a screenshot? Look, no, yeah, I got it. Hold on. How, to, how does that play it again? Huh? I think did you craft the, uh, the name? Well, hold on. I got it. I got it. Yeah. Look at it play. See? Pull down a bit. Pull down. Can you down. see? Can you see? Yeah. Just let, let it down. Okay. So that you these are nails. Yep. So, to be fair and fun is so cool. <laughs> so, it's going to be really cool. And congratulations to the winner of last week. So, the last week winner will win. Again, I'm going to show you again. It's a glitch crystal trifecta. And it comes with condensed glue gels, no wipe top coat, Precision um, glue, I hope precision glue, so it's like a whole three bestie here. And of course, you have another bestie, which is your mixed crystal. Congratulations to the winner, and thank you so much. So don't miss the chance to win for this week. And we're going to post this, and all you need to do is repost. Make sure you tag us and hashtag Glitz Accessory and Such and Glitz Contest. And on our page, tag one of your bestie on the post that we post tag one of bestie um if you're not sure let us know so then you won't miss that um um so messy make sure when you repost the post and you tag us and you hashtag glitz accessory and such and then on your post on our post make sure you tag one of your bestie so then you can whenever they're checking if you tag your bestie they go to your page and they make sure you check so that everybody will get um a chance to win so yes yeah, so tag us and hashtag so awesome so Congratulations to the winners of this week. On Monday, we have Just Being Raised, the winning of Treasure Bags Challenge. And for Miss Beats Barbie, winning our trifecta for last week. So we still have a Baby Mick Jar contest going on and November 22nd is a deadline. So make sure if you haven't, just 
make sure you post a picture and tag us um, all the information on our contest you can see it on our contest highlights or if you have any question you can comment right on that post that we say is the gliss uh, baby mix shot contest so so make sure you do all of that so that's way we can able to see and count you in and if you have any questions just let us know and i will see you tomorrow night check out our 20% uh, off of autumn sales right now it's going on really cool and strong and a lot of cool things you can find it in the five dollars nail art sections and there's a lot of things you i'm gonna doing a quick sneak peek so something's really cool we have like so cool of 13 different brushes i can't wait to go this is a baby brush as cap too but i will take the cap on the side because there's so many cap to protect your brush and i can't wait to show you how you can create a lot of different cool designs and flowers from this uh, it's really simple easy and this is really cool you can do with so many different designs with And more thank you mama Vic thank you thank you everyone yes so we have a lot more things coming out we we'll make sure you guys always have new toys to look at yeah so have fun Me message and I see say either or either you post it or on your Facebook if you're on Facebook so if you're on Facebook, you can enter on Facebook too. So if you are on Instagram, you can do um, tags and share. Or if you're on Facebook. So that works for both of the platform, Facebook and Instagram. So if you are on it, you can do it this week. You can do this week and you can repost it. Tag us and hashtag Gliss Assistance and such and Gliss Contest. And make sure you tag one of your besties. There's more of giveaway. So we're going to have so much fun. And we're gonna do so many fun things together. And yes, and the brush gonna be coming out probably this week or next week, so stay tuned. Yes, so I can't wait to a lot of cool things because this one, I got all the different cool things that we can do designs with. I know that uh, Dom will love this one because she's like, look at that. I can create so many cool things with our gel painting. And this is a mini brush, it's so freaking stunning. And stay tuned for a lot of cool things. You never know. A next game we're gonna play with, like, okay, who guess what numbers? We have some ideas for a uh, spinning like games again. Tell us if you are ready to play because we are going to do it soon. For the baby mix jars, for the baby mix jars, uh, giveaway for baby mix jars. Um, for two colors i get for the baby mix jars i mean the contest for baby mix jars Mi miria miria is for baby mix jar make sure when you do your contest for baby mix jars you will post on your post on your uh, page and then you will tag us at glitz accessory and such and hashtag us so like this okay so here's a something is might be conf um might be confused i will tell you why it's confused because when you put like fonts and you put at on your comments right at glitz accessory and such so it's only mention us but it doesn't go into our page so if you do like um it's really it's really a little bit it's it's, it's so a little bit confused but it's not really really, really confused so if you just comment like baby make sure at gliss so it means that you comment and then you just mention it. this is mentioned but if you click on your own pictures and you click tag gliss accessory and such then we can see that one is going to our page so if that makes sense to you so that way we are in the same page so we don't miss anything sometimes we have to go into with searching so much 
we couldn't searching like for your entry if we're missing it if we're missing it, it's really sad so we'll make sure that we are if we're searching for if anyone missing which comment like you know can you do this so then that way we can see it so it's just it's just like to to make sure that we are entering so yep do you like the videos like we're doing it today I need some uh, feedback Oh, here, I get it. Oh, I'm on Instagram. I'm on Facebook. Yeah, I'm on Facebook. So, yes, when you post a picture, go to where it says tag and tag them. Yes, absolutely right, CC. CC just right. Um, oh, she's ready. Yes, the, the brush is going to drop really soon. Okay. Hey, Chio. Thank you so much. I'm so glad you like it. So, we're going to go live again tomorrow. And let me know what you want to see. And if you like it like this, we'll do two nails. And we'll get some time to talk and Q&A. So, then we can support um, all of you with a lot of questions you might have for us. And good luck today, everyone. Make sure you are reposting it. If you like to participate, just having fun and win a lot. So I'm excited. I can't wait. Oh, thank you, Eric. Yes, yes. So I will see you tomorrow. I love you all. And check out all everything on our website. If you're interested in with a lot of cool things, you can find it just simply in the $5 nail art. And I will see you tomorrow. Love you all. Please be safe and take care. Bye-bye.